YouTube, what is going on? Courage here for what is another momentous day at the 100 Thieves Content House. I am extremely excited to announce that I have re-signed with 100 Thieves for over the next year. Cannot wait to continue to build great things with this incredible team here uh, in Los Angeles. From top to bottom, I love working with everyone at 100 Thieves. They are the absolute best in the industry. And as a little bit of a celebration gift, 100 Thieves and Cash App, Surprise me with what is the biggest investment into my streaming setup that I've ever had in my history. It is the most ridiculous streaming room I've ever been in, and I think you guys will be blown away by what you see if you've tuned into my streams in the past. So, if you're watching this right now and you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. We're on the road to 3 million subs as we just broke 2.6 million earlier this week. Second, make sure you like the video. And third, let me know what you guys want to see me do in this room. You're going to see some new things that I've never had before, and I want your guys' help on what we should use. Without further ado, let's get into it. My brand new, state-of-the-art, over $25,000 investment into my brand new streaming room. Come on in. And already, there's a lot of things to take in, all right? As we uh, take note, You'll remember certain things, but you'll also see a lot of changes. And this is not done, it's still a work in progress. Yes, there's been some major updates, but I do wanna tweak it in some ways. So first off, I'm remaining in the 100 Thieves house. I'm still here, we've just overhauled the room. My old setup, to be honest, was solid, but quite laughable for where I'm at in my career. Um, I should have invested in it earlier, and I know that uh, I was probably uh, missing the beat on that, but thankfully Cash App and 100 Thieves kind of took me under their wing and uh, made it all happen. First the background of the stream, what you guys will see. They hooked it up right here with a textured wall to help with soundproofing. It's got hue lights running through the entire thing so I can change the colors. For now, obviously the Courage blue and yellow to fit right on in with the neon sign of my logo. You guys absolutely love this in the background. I love this in the background. So many of you guys ask where I get it from, if you could get one yourselves. This was custom made for me when uh, I had this room originally furnished back when we moved in here in January. I love this thing, it just ties in the room. It's a great thing to have in the background, but yes, you might be used to seeing that, but now there's a lot more to look at. We've cleaned this up, and you'll see as we head towards this wall, certain things that'll continue to fit in with the rest of the theme of the room. Uh, to begin, Mountain Dew Game Fuel Fridge, keeping me hydrated, keeping me locked in, all the accuracy and alertness I could need to dominate people in Warzone, one of my proud sponsors there in Mountain Dew Game Fuel. So thank you to you guys, another one of my proud sponsors, Cash App. I left this on overnight and uh, guess what? Completely burned out the battery. So that's my fault, Cash App. Don't be upset at me if you don't use Cash App, then uh, but, uh, 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 fuck you. <laughs> Over here, my two plaques I have right now, the Courage 1 mil plaque for this channel. I also have the Courage 100,000 plaque for this channel. I have another 100K plaque on the way for the More Courage JD channel. Swap, but make sure you put it in the top of the description. If you guys haven't subbed on up over there, you can still be in the first 250,000 subscribers. The love on those videos has been insane, so thank you guys so much. As we pan further up, the 2020 Courage jersey, as it'll fit in really well with the rest of the room as we get towards it, you'll see kind of a recurring theme. My parents got me these great gifts back over Christmas of framed uh, of my original apparel that I've had across the years to kind of take note of memories and momentous occasions in my career in the past. Now we've got the full decal on the wall of the Courage logo. I'm gonna smooth it out a bit, make it look that much cleaner, but just a great little accent to really tie the room together well. So this is now gonna be your mainstream background. I've got all the area I could want to move around, dance, be a goofball, and that you guys know and love. But I think it's stunning. I love that I can change all these with a click of a button, which we'll see as we get towards the main setup. But let's pan towards the other side of the room. If you've watched my streams, you'll remember that these chairs used to be seated over here. Now they've been shifted into this corner. And sure, there's a lot of wires and stuff running right now. Soon these will be bat run off batteries, so you'll have less wires in the ground. This is my old camera. It's now set up for what's gonna be kind of the Courage cast area. Imagine this, Friday night, I had drinks on stream, Nade Shot comes in. Well, Matt and I can take a seat here with our custom Courage and 100 Thieves mic flags to be able to sit down, chat with the camera, chat with you guys on the stream. It is already all set up with my stream, one click of a button, and I'm in an entirely different area of my room. Let's say we have a casting event, right? Do some online casting. I get suited on up, have a co-caster here, maybe an, another Uno tournament or something along those lines. It can all be done from right here. I wanna hear your guys' ideas of what you want from this corner in the room. Obviously, it can all be interchanged. We can raise up that camera, get rid of these chairs, have a standing type set. It also looks great with the 
uh, fall 2019 takeover apparel. You've got the 2017 spring Owen 15 donut, the original piece of merchandise I dropped. So I just love that the setup is more dynamic now. You know, you can feel how each area of the room has plays a very important role. Instead of it being dead space, now you've got this lounge type content creation area that'll be set up here for whenever I need. It's really easy to just move these uh, lights, move this camera off to the side, and now the floor is clear. I do want to get a, a new rug. That's one of the updates I want to make to the room. This one's pretty damn dirty. We don't need to show that. But yeah, so amped on this. It's a fun little idea. And we actually have three of these microphones. So third person could be joined as well um, to just add a, something that I don't think has really ever been done from someone in a stream setup before. Kind of that living area where you can quickly transition over, over to to have great conversations. So that's area number two of the room. You've got the stream background. You've got kind of the Courage Cast interview area. But without further ado, why you guys all tuned on in, the setup tour, this thing is absolutely mind blowing. Roger, pan on over. This is where the biggest investment was made into my streaming setup. So if you didn't know, the big thing that everyone uses, 240 hertz monitors. Well, every major streamer uses it. I never did, I always played on 144 hertz. Well now, instead of one 240 hertz monitor, 100 Thieves and Cash App gave me three identical 27 inch 240 hertz curved monitors all mounted on the back of the desk. I've never had my monitors mounted. So it's nice and clean, can easily be moved around, can be spun, can be lifted on up. Right now I just have a matching across. These are perfect because I have two PCs courtesy of one of my proud sponsors, NZXT through the NZXT build program. You'll see the link in the description, but they're currently rested below the desk, one on each side. My gaming PC on the left, my streaming PC here on the right. These things are absolute beasts. They are titans. The streaming PC can output and record at 20,000 bit rate without any issue, without without the anything be, being overloaded. Looks crisp as hell. I think I have one of the highest stream qualities out there. You'll also see, be seeing some new graphics coming from VBI, who I always work with. Now another big change, I've got two key lights, so I won't have just one bright ass light on the front of my face. It gives me better lighting for my stream, which ma which matches well with my brand new uh, Sony R7. What is uh, it, Roger? A7R. And it matches well with my brand new Sony A7R. The thing is beautiful, 16 by 35 millimeter lens. Got that beautiful bokeh right to the background, some autofocus action, so when my fat ass gets up and dance, dances, you guys will see me clear as ever. You're gonna see every hair on my face, every pore on my skin. You're gonna see things about me that you probably don't even wanna see, but guess what? State of the art camera setup, state of the art lighting setup, 50 inch 4K flat screen TV. I'm back up to four monitors now. With that, I'll be able to throw my OBS up there, monitor how I look, keep my chat right where I want it so I can interact with you guys, which is so important to me, have the rest of my Spotify, my Streamlabs, anything I need to be a successful streamer on these monitors while I game and play and do what I do best, which is win games and fall guys and drop 20 bombs uh, and carry Tim in uh, Warzone. Some fucking shit! Game set up, I still have my wonderful Herman Miller and body chair. Not a sponsor, but incredible chair. Worth the investment. Yeah, it's 1500 bucks, but guess what? I sit in the damn thing eight to 10 hours a day across 365 days in a year. It's like in one year, for having great back support, it's like 0.3 cents per hour. Makes sense to me to make an investment like that. When it's my job, uh, I've got a brand new Elgato Stream Deck XL to match my original Elgato Stream Deck. Now with one click of a button, if you look at that back wall there, I can you know turn off the lights, I can wind up changing all the colors of the lights, which I'll wind up programming and getting into more. Still have my beautiful Razer Black Shark V2 headset. Love this thing, love how clean it is. Razer keyboard, Razer mice. As you guys know, proud member of the Razer family. We've also re-signed with them, so they're gonna continue to support the stream and the Courageous because we have some exciting announcements to come. That is a first teaser here. I might get in trouble for it, but guess what? You will wanna stay tuned to mine and Razer's social media for some of the stuff we've got cooking up. Sure SM7B microphone mixed on into a Pro FX10 mixer. Another mic with a custom 100 Thieves and Courage mic flag, all resting on my other game fuel fridge, just in case I don't want to walk five feet to that one. I can stack this one up as well for a quick on the go, boom, grab of the game fuel. So that's a look at the desk. Also what I love, boom, complete sitting and standing desk. And as I take a seat here, Roger, if you want to just pan on over to just how good and crisp this camera shot looks. It goes in with the autofocus and you can see here just how clean it is 
such an upgrade on my last setup, like night and day. So more and more of what you guys love here on stream. So overall, this setup didn't come overnight. I, I, I can't believe that we're now here. I'm, I'm living my dream here in Los Angeles, working with the team I want to be part of in 100 Thieves, continuing to collaborate with my brother, Nade Shah, as we continue to take over this whole industry. Um, I'll look at it again. This is not just an overnight success thing. As you guys know, I always like to preach kind of what I've experienced. This was years and years of hard work for this to happen. And to now have Cash App to say, hey, you know what, we're gonna cover all of this. Uh, it really means the world. So make sure you guys support Cash App and show them some love. With that being said, what can you expect from me? Well, more streams than ever before now. I'm so motivated to get in, get to work on this brand new streaming setup. If you're watching this right now, I'll be live for the first stream ever on this setup tomorrow. That actually might be a lie. I think I'm gonna do a test stream the day before, but either way, you guys will see it right away on stream. You're not gonna wanna miss it. What do you guys like most about the room? Let me know down below. Make sure you leave a like on this video. And uh, with that being said, my brand new 2020 stream room setup tour is complete. Thank you again to 100 Thieves and Cash App. I'm so excited to be back again. YouTube, that's it for me today. Be sure to sub to the second channel. See you guys next time, all right? Peace.